hi guys welcome back again to my channel if you're new here you already know don't waste time just go ahead and subscribe we drop videos every week and turn on your post notification and also click the link down below for more information on all my ebooks okay guys so many of you was in my dms asking me for a discount code because i ended the last one and then you wanted to take advantage okay so i'm gonna provide you guys with a new code so you can enjoy this sale that's going to last today only so i put the code up here and it's also going to be in the box down so click it and enjoy okay guys welcome back again to my channel so i wanted to make um this quick video for you guys because i have gotten some dms because people wanted to know how to you know how to determine shipping because you know a lot of you you know you just put your product on your website and then shipping is the same price for everything like i see some of you have seven dollar shipping and it doesn't matter if you buy like a combo set. Like let's say I went to somebody's website, okay? She's like somebody who wants to work with me, but so basically if you go to her website, you get like a combo, okay? That's just an example. Shipping is $7, that's how she put it. And then if you get just the treatment, for example, it's still $7. And this is my smallest product. It is our Haitian black castor oil. It's also $7. For me, is that you are losing out on money. Because if you go to the post office and the combo set is definitely more than a pound. And the customer pays $7 for shipping, let's, let's say. And then you go to the post office, it's like $10. You are losing out $3. So you have to weigh your product correctly so i'm making this video once and for all for the people who's been dming me they don't know how to calculate shipping they don't know how to you know weigh their product so that they're not losing out on shipping you cannot just have one price for shipping for everything let's say someone order like seven product like let's say seven someone order seven product and then you charge them only six dollars but when you go to the post office they're gonna make you get one of those priority boxes the price for priority and then the price for first class is two different things first class packages are cheaper than priority so therefore you have to properly um weigh your product so that you can enter it on your website and your shipping information so that when the customer purchase they'll know um the 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 system should already calculate um the price of the shipping me i use shopify for that's the e-commerce platform that i use um and i use the carrier that i use to ship up my packages i use the usps which is the united states post office and i use dhl for international shipping so what you're gonna do you need to get yourself a scale and you need to get like a piece of paper or you can get um let me just enter my password and like a, i have like a notepad for example um this is the castor oil this is the combo set stimulating black soap conditioner and scalp moisturizer so basically i'm gonna take the weight of each product and i'm gonna write it down so when it's time to go to my website so that i'll be able to plug it in so that i'll know how to calculate shipping properly and i'm gonna i want to use shopify guys so i don't use um wix i don't use um big cartel godaddy or wordpress i only use um shopify so i'm familiar with shopify and i'm gonna show you guys how to enter um how to let's say i'm adding a product how to enter the weight um of the product on the website okay so you need to you need to get yourself a scale this scale is literally i think it's under 20 dollars i think it's 20 or 19. it might be cheaper actually let me check let me check um how much this scale is i'm gonna go to amazon right now i'm gonna um, type scale okay this is the one that i have guys so as you can see oh it's not focusing but this one right here i got it from amazon it is only 22 dollars okay is it can you guys see it is it only tw it's only 22 dollars you need this this is a lifesaver okay so let me show you how you work this we are going to turn it on 
as you can see it's on but the lighting the wing light uh, can't really see but it is on right now the weight of the castor oil this is the Haitian castor oil I just don't have a label right now and you're gonna place it you see if I move it the number is moving right here right here this is where she right now is on zero and make sure you set it to it's on pound and ounces okay so let me put this down okay so this castor oil guys is four ounce as you can see the four is right here is because I'm using the ring light you can't really I have to turn the light down so you press this you press and hold and it's gonna take it to zero so this is four ounce point four so you're gonna write it here you're gonna go to your notes you're gonna put four point it says three or four i don't know so ounce now we're gonna go to the combo sets make sure this is at zero every time you weigh a product you take it out make sure it's at zero okay so now we're gonna do a combo set. For example, on my website, I have a combo, which is a conditioner, a shampoo, um, scalp moisturizer, put it somewhere here, and then my oil, okay? So you guys can see, this is three products. So this, you guys don't mind my nails, okay? So this combo set is one pound, and 13 ounces okay as you can see it's right here you see the one this is the one is in front of the lb lb stands for a uh, pound and oz stands for ounce as you can see one pound here and point 13 ounces you don't have to worry about that four there it's one pound here 13 ounces I'm taking this information so that I can go and put it on my website, okay? So this is a combo set because you gotta have the right um, weight, guys, for your product. And let's do the oil. Let's see this oil here. This oil is literally, it's also four ounce. Yeah, the oil. Four ounce. So I just put it here, and um, I hope this helps, guys, because people have been asking me. I'm just helping you. Well, this cup moisturizer is five ounce, as you can see, five point two. But you can just put five ounce; it doesn't really matter. So just put five. I just write it down as a note, like I said, five ounce. As you can see, so that when it's time to like enter everything, I can have this as a reference. Um, and this one here is nine ounce. This is the hair mask. Oh, actually, it's ten ounce. It's ten okay and of course all condition this okay this is the conditioner it's nine ounces i can say nine ounces so 9.7 9.7 ounces in the black soap guys the number i'm looking for is right here this is zero so it's zero pound but 10 ounce, as you can see, I'm looking at these two numbers here. Right here, there's no number. So I'm not worrying about this number because it's zero. So right now it's 10, 10 ounce. Okay, that's one. So let's say on my website, I sell the conditioner and the shampoo together so i'll put this here this is one order okay this is one combo so this combo is is one pound let me put it together to see 
is one pound and four ounces, okay? So I'll just write that down. So I have the conditioner and shampoo. Conditioner and shampoo, that's one pound and four ounce, okay? So that's basically how you calculate, um, how you determine your, um, your weight. So basically, if you have 10 product, guys, let's say you, ha you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven product, you have to take um, the weight of each product individually by themselves and then you enter it on your website. But if you sell a combo set, a combo set meaning you sell multiple products together, let's say say four products together, you have to take all that full product and weigh it together because that's one order. If you go to my website, for example, so let's say you go to my website. Um, hold on, guys. Let me go to let's go to Divine Kinky. I know you're not seeing my face, but so let's say you go to my website. That's my website. You see, I have one combo i have a combo here i have a combo there and another combo here so i have to make sure i take the weight of this whole combo here that has six product in it, in it. so I'm, i'll put all the six product here and i'll look to see if it's one pound or two pound and i'll do the same thing for each combo because this is one one order when someone order they're ordering this kit so this kit the the weight of the skit is not going to be the same as let's say someone buy a, an oil for example so you have to make sure you weigh out all your products so you're not missing out on shipping so you're not losing money like i said i went to somebody's website and let's say you're buying an oil the shipping price is the same as if you were buying like a whole combo like you're missing out clearly it's like the more they buy, the the higher the shipping could be. So you have to make sure you're taking the weight of all your product. Okay? Let me know if you guys have any questions. So guys, I'm going to show you guys a little demonstration on my phone. Again, this is for Shopify because I only use Shopify. I'm only familiar with Shopify. If you use any other software, I cannot help you. If you use like Wix, Wix, I don't know, that's how I said. If you use Wix, if you use Big Cartel, if you use WordPress, if you use GoDaddy, I cannot help you because I don't use that um, e-commerce platform. I use Shopify. So I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to act like I'm entering a new product. And I'll show you guys how I do that for Shopify. Okay? I hope this video helped you guys. And I decided to make this video because I don't want to keep answering questions via DMs. Like I said, I have people... Who always ask i mean this video is also for my mentees as well so they can always come back and come to this video if they have any questions because they also see it and also for anybody on youtube okay i hope this video was clear enough i wanted to show you guys how i do this so that i don't miss out on shipping and you always want to add an extra box on your shipping because you want to be able to um to cover the cost of the boxes that you're using, the tape that you're using. Let's say regular shipping is $6. You can add another $2 on it that make it $8 so that you can cover for the boxes, for the tape, for everything that you're using. So you guys, make sure you guys are wise when you're in business. Make sure you count your time. Um, you always got to count your time and pay yourself and make sure that you are not losing, okay? So I'm going to show you guys a little demonstration on how I'm going to enter a product okay so you guys um this is the note that i took this is the weight of this product so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a little um screen recording on how i would enter a product okay bye thank you guys for watching and don't forget to click the link in the bio guys i have four ebooks um available for you guys i have the beauty brand i have the beauty brand blueprint i have the you know how to build business credit that's two i have the one where you if you want to get private label and formulation done that's another one and i have another ebook where 
with my packaging and stuff what's the fifth one guys i don't remember i don't even remember oh my god what is the other ebook that i have um this miss guys one second hey, my name is russell brunson i want to see a free copy of my brand new book called funnel if you go to my thing and then the other one, yes, go your business. Um, go your business using social media. Yes. So go your business using social media. I have all my ebooks are here actually. Oh, where the hell are they? Um, not now. All my ebooks are here. One, two, three, four, five. So go your business using social media because it's important to use social media for your business. Um, the beauty brand blueprint, um, business one one because it's important to start building business credit. Um, and private label to be able to start your hair care and skincare, how to get a formulation and all of that. Yeah. So click the link in the bio, guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Okay, guys, I'm going to act like I'm adding a product to my store so I can show you guys where to go to add the weight of the product. Again, this is for Shopify. So as you can see, I added the combo set that I have on my website and I just name it combo kit or combo package, whichever you want to call it. And just put a little description because you have to describe the product, what's in it, what is it for, what does it do. And now we are going to go to price. I, I'm just picking any price because I'm just demonstrating um, to you guys how you go about adding a product you can add inventory um, you can add shipping information i think there's a place here where my okay address guys i had to showing, cut it because my so address was showing okay it, now as you can see where it says shipping information it says zero pound you see that little van that um and to the right you can see where you can change it to pound kilograms ounces and now we're gonna put it on on uh, not ounce on pound because we're doing the combo set the combo set was like one pound and 13 ounce i think that's what it was if i'm not mistaken i don't have the note in front of me as you can see weight use the calc use to calculate shipping sorry guys <laughs> so i am putting the weight of the combo kit was one pound and 13 ounce okay so this is how you add the weight of your product as you can see now shipping is in entered now you can add inventory and everything else um let me know if this video was clear if you need any information leave me a comment